Good evening to everybody. Welcome to the TSAP last set. And uh, today's session is uh, correctly the 20th session. This uh, 20 second. Uh, what I say, 20 rounds are over that I can keep in this manner. Yes. And then uh, we are the three total uh, host. Number one, it is me, Professor uh, Dr. Mohammed Sivusen. Number two, the co host is uh, Kolikonda. Sharad Babu, who is in the middle, you could see the photo on the extreme right. You could find the uh, the co-host uh, three, that is Motamari Sri Vidya, and uh, whose uh, um, what I say WhatsApp numbers also given over there. And uh, please uh, give us the feedback to us because that is immense value to us uh, to improve our online classes. So that is the request that we made it. Uh, because we know that uh, we are not committing a mistakes. No, our mistakes will not be known to us. It will be observed by the people like you. So that was the thing actually we have the belief uh, and hence that we are requesting you to send the, uh, the feedback to us. Yes, with this, uh, I would like to say the only yes. admit that uh, even we can also go wrong because we are also human beings. So you are free to correct us wherever we go wrong, if at all you find out. Because uh, we also search and we also try hard uh, uh, to make this, uh, 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 make these questions, to prepare these questions and find out the answers. That's why your uh, feedback uh, will be of immense value to us. Yes, shall I begin? Of course, I will begin only three or four, which I want to make it out first. Later on that, I'll hand out to our Kolikunda Sarad Babu. The first question, what is odd man out? Bus, train, street, country. Sir, uh, this is a very tough no, sir. Bus, we know it is a road transport. Train is also road transport, but is in the rails. But how come the streets are... Again, street is a part of the city and country is a part of the world. So, train uh, and street, all these are used for uh, communication, travel, but country is not used. Uh, your answer is right, but uh, actually analogy is different because the, the way that I framed it is entirely different. Uh, but anyway, the answer is right. Uh, feedback is right. But it is very strange to me also because bus is a feminine gender, train is a feminine gender, street is a feminine gender, and country is a masculine gender. So that is the reason it is the odd one out. But anyway, whatever the reason would be, the logic is there. The co-host has given the right answer. That is the, that is the, yes, that is the right answer is, Country. <laughs> we love the blank with the suitable words. Yes. How many colors are there in the Google logo? Sir, uh, uh, just on my smartphone. La. Okay. Sir, we would like to see now only the smartphone. How many colors are there? The three, four, five, six. Answer is four. Yes. Yes. Answer is option one, sir. No, four colors. I will show four you. Four colors are already there in Google Chrome. Yeah, uh, because generally the Google logo, which is uh, there is a Chrome is different again. Google Chrome is different again. But here we'll uh, make it out because uh, uh, four colors are there in Chrome also. Yes, yes. Okay. How many primary colors are there in the Google? What are the primary colors? How many are there? Answer is three. Three. Yes, I will give you the what are the colors are there. Green, it is the green, yellow, and red. Yes, yes, yes. Because the three primary colors are is the correct sequence is here. What is the the no actually blue, red, and yellow. That is the um, then the overall the color colors are there. But uh, what is the correct sequence of these uh, three primary co colors? Blue, red, yellow, or red, blue, yellow? Yes? Option two, sir. 
Now option three, red, yellow, blue. That is the correct sequence. Not yellow, red and blue. So the correct sequence of the three primary colors are red, yellow and blue is the correct primary colors sequence. How many secondary colors? Sir, I'm going to move it, I'm going to move it. So those are also three, these are also three. Why not more? No, only three. How many secondary colors? Only three. That is, uh, yes, what is the right sequence? What are the three? You can say orange, violet, green. Those are three colors. What is the right sequence is? Orange, violet, green or orange, green, violet or orange, violet, uh, green or green, orange, violet, which is the proper sequence. Yes, make a trial. Even though it is wrong, no minus max. Answer is two. Orange, green, violet. These are the sequences. How many tertiary colors are there? Tertiary colors. Tertiary colors. Mean third type of the colors. How many are there? Sir, primary three, secondary three. Definitely, sir, tertiary is also three. No. Answer is six. Answer is six tertiary color. What are they? Red orange, yellow orange, yellow green, blue green, blue violet, red violet. These are called tertiary colors. I repeat, red orange, yellow orange, yellow green, blue green, blue violet, or red violet. Okay, now, how are the tertiary colors are formed? How they are formed? Black and white, green and red, red and yellow or by mixing the primary with the secondary colors? Answer is, by mixing the primary with the secondary colors, you will generate total tertiary, that is, uh, six tertiary colors. Yes. How many colors are double? Which one is, it is in the proper sequence? See, in the Google, we have the double colors. But what is the right sequence? Green, red and blue, yellow, blue and red. There are colors which are doubled in the Google. The sequence is? Yes, yes repeat. Four. Four, blue and red, that is the sequence. Now, what is the sequence of the color in the Google logo that... Uh, Blue, red, yellow, blue, red, green. Sequence, sequence. Answer is? Three. Two. It is a blue, red, yellow, blue, green, red. So what is repeated? What is repeated? Blue and red. Blue and red. Now the last question is? See, this is the Google, Google logo. The original designer of the Google logo is Ruth Kedari, Ruth Kedar, Ruth Poddar, Reed Kedar. The original designer of the Google logo is, yes, yes, repeat, repeat, Ruth Kedar, number two. Okay, now I will switch over to the, because some people are open, unmute, unmute, because I am getting the resound, see, I am getting the resound, yes, yes, now the turn is our lead friend, co-host, Kolikanda, Sharad Babu, yes, uh, now your turn is there and uh, you stopped at the, at what place that you stopped? 16th you have to do, I because you, 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 you did the, this Uti Shimla, Bangalore, that because you said the Brindavan Garden on the day. So now from the 16th you have to continue it, okay. Your turn Hello. will start now. Thank you, sir. Once again, uh, good evening to all. Yesterday I stopped at... Uh, Question number 15, I completed it and now 
I'm going to start, start since, since from question 16. 16. Which is Which state, is of, state no, of no known land? Of land of yeah, yeah, no please, just a minute, just a minute, just a minute. People are kept it open. The resound I am getting, people are kept it open. Now you can mute it, then you speak. Sarat Babu. Okay, sir. Yes, now you speak. Which is a state known as a river of uh, land of five rivers? So one state is known as land, known as land of five rivers. What is it? Is it Haryana? Is it Patna? Or is it Punjab? Or is it Chandigarh? Punjab. Yes, correct. Punjab. Yes. The the word itself denotes that. Uh, uh, there are five waters. Anj, so Anj let, let, let us see the feedback. Punjab is the only state in India which is named so because of the five rivers, namely Satles, Bias, Ravi, Chenab, and Jhelum. The word Punjab is made up of two Persian words. Actually, it is a Persian word. Tanj means five, Ab means water. So the word Punjab means land of five rivers. And now 16A, which river was earlier known as a river of sorrows? Not now, of course. It was Daniel. earlier known as a river of sorrows because it brought a lot of sorrow whenever it uh, fled. Hugli, Damodar, Tapti, Godavari. Hugli, Damodar, Tapti, Godavari. What's the river that is known as river of sorrows? Option two, sir. Yes, please uh, loudly. You Option answer two, loud. Sir. Yes, that is the correct answer. Damodar was earlier known as Sorrow of Bengal, but now it has turned into a river of emotion, the bank of love. It's not uh, that someone has visited, uh, that I have visited Damodar River once in my lifetime. Damodar is the river one must do. See if we go to West Bengal, we can watch. We can see this uh, river. Which city is called City of Joy? Is it Madurai or is it Bengaluru or is it Kolkata? Or is it Patna? City of Joy. So one question may come out of uh, all these uh, cities, uh, uh, which are very famous for uh, some. Acronyms are some nicknames. Is it Madurai or is it Bengaluru or is it Kolkata or is it Patna? The city of joy is uh, Kolkata. Why is Kolkata known as city of joy? For its, it, it is known for its soulful embodiment of culture, love, mystery, respect, enthusiasm, and definitely some amazing sweet delicacies. Kolkata, as it is now referred to as a city that upholds perfect juxtaposition between the old world and the modern world. Now, 17th question. Which city is known as Sorrow of India? Is it Tiruvannathapuram or is it Kolkata or is it Patna or is it Allahabad? Which city is known as Sorrow of India? Already I have given some hint regarding this because of course I refer to a state yes the city the city that is known as sorrow of India is Kolkata Kolkata is known as the sorrow of India Damodar river was earlier known as river of sorrows of course Hugli, Aura, Mednapur districts uh, even now, the floods sometimes affect the lower Damodar Valley, but the havoc it wreaked in earlier years is now a matter of history. Of course, now River Damodar is not causing such an havoc in the recent uh, years. 18th question Which city is known as City of Lakes? Jaipur, Udaipur, Laspur, Kanapur. Which city is known as City of Lakes? It is Jaipur. full of lakes. Option two, oh, sorry. It is Udaipur. Udaipur is known as City of Lakes. Option 2 is the right answer. And uh, it is picturesque and elegant. Uh, the city Udaipur is known as uh, 
city of lakes and now uh, which city is called the pink city of india udaipur jaipur kanpur jaipur yes now your answer is right the pink city is jaipur jaipur is known as uh, a pink city it is one of india's architectural wonders a romantic dusty pink hue which has defined the city since 1876 after it was painted pink to welcome queen victoria's husband prince albert gives jaipur the name pink city and it is commonly known by that name now question this is the nine. pink city yes now question number 19 which city is known as the diamond city of india jaipur bijapur bilaspur surat so i think this business is uh, there in that state and uh, you can surat yes surat it is in gujarat and uh, gujarat you know it is famous for jewels and diamonds that uh, Nirav Modi, who has escaped from this country to other country, is known for his business, jewels and diamonds business. And it is also known as the Silk City, the Diamond City, the Green City. Twentieth question is, which state in Punjab produces plenty of wheat? Which uh, which state? Punjab, Haryana, Uttar Pradesh, Kerala. Which state produces? the highest uh, quantity of uh, yield of uh, wheat haryana oh uh, it is uh, option 3 that is uttar pradesh tops the list uh, in production or in the yielding of uh, wheat actually its total production is 25.32 million tons every year followed by punjab 15.78 metric million tons and madhya pradesh with uh, 14.18 million tons 21 question number 21 is in re bruno in re bruno case in re bruno in re bruno that should be a combined word in re bruno case which high court take up shomoto case on animal cruelty in the memory of dog killed by three persons karnataka kerala ap tp which case in uh, the bruno case which i quote whether it is karnataka or whether it is kerala or is it ap or is it tp kerala yes it is a kerala case in which uh, sumoto case was taken uh, against the animal cruelty and uh, that state is kerala and to that state the high court belongs said 22nd question is live law started in dash and bar and bench which launched in 2009 2012 2012 13 2014 2015 yes 2012 2013 it was launched drive uh, law and uh, this bar bench you can see the magazine or uh, newspaper also in a woman's hands Uh, that is bar bench magazine live, live la class chal raha hai hamara what atalwa <laughs> pralad when you speak you unmute it when you speak that one that you can mute it because every time you are getting unmute we are getting the resound okay thank you sir mute mute because uh, two times i closed it two times what yes. is the third question if you say that someone is behind bars you mean that they are in pub or they are in restaurant or they are in hospital or they are in prison one who is behind bars it is familiarly known to every person it should be known to every person one who is going to appear for ts lawset or ap lawset or for any, that matter for any law aspiring student because you are going to move bail petition for them those for who are behind bars option four is on option four is the correct answer that is prison so prison is uh, the uh, the same term for behind bars and 24th question is what is meant by rex 
queen crown king khalifa it is a latin terminology rex crown king yeah. khalifa it sometimes comes in your uh, whenever when you join uh, law college in your law books you will get it rex that word also you will get and uh, what is rex or single or also tense or versus abdullah Yes. Option three. Option three is the correct answer. That is king. Rex means king. Uh, I, uh, one book is there in literature. Rex uh, Oedipus. Rex Oedipus means a Oedipus the king. That means. So twenty fifth question is Regina means crown, queen, king, knight. Regina means crown, queen. king knight queen yes uh, it is the opposite of rex regina means queen 26 question is according to the urban legend if the statue shows the horse posed with both front hooves up in the air the rider dash in battle if the horse is posed with one foot leg up it means the rider was dash in battle or died of battle wound option sir died wounded wounded died only one correct only two correct you have seen the statue so, no so there is a horse and uh, it posed with front hooves up in the air and the rider dash in battle so when they are whenever the front foot uh, front hooves are up in the air that denotes something about the rider and if the horse uh, is posed with uh, one front leg up uh, it means uh, something about the riders so what is it only only one is the correct answer that is uh, died wounded it shows the died wounded whenever the horse is posed both front hooves up in the air that means the rider died after getting wounded in battle that is the uh, answer for this 26th question and now 27th question is what is the color of the water colorless not colorless slightly blue tint slight green as nature is green colorless option one actually the answer should be colorless sir no they say slight blue tint actual color of water whenever we we have to strictly say no you see the, you, you, you see the lakes and you see the seas yes the for water is in fact not colorless even pure water is not colorless but has a slight blue tint to it best seen when looking to a long column of water so the op option 3 is the correct answer slight blue tint slightly blue next next question is 28th question who is the muscular woman in india hardik choudhary deepika choudhary sushma choudhary vasant choudhary who is the muscular yes uh, deepika choudhary because the feedback has already been given so deepika choudhary his name is very much prominent one in international indian female bodybuilders the 34 year old is india's first female ifbb international federation of bodybuilding and fitness professional so deepika choudhary is the correct answer muscular woman of india 29 question india's golden girl who was so fast that uh, she was nicknamed after a train payoli express is it pt usha or is it himadas or is deepak malik or is it deepa karmakar pt usha pt usha she hails from payoli a very small village near calicut and her full name is pekatarambil hello hello look and it's pekataram tekka parambil usha kelavulak kandi tekka parambil usha and she is also known as golden deer bangaru lady 
she is also known as Paoli Express. And uh, 30th question is, who is the melody queen of India? Asha Bhosle, Alka Yagnik, Lata Mangeshkar, Shreya Ghoshal. Lata Mangeshkar. Yes, Lata your answer is right. Third option is the right one. She is known as melody queen of India. Lata Mangeshkar, the queen of melody, born on 14th of October 2019. Yes. The third, yes. th 30th question is over, sir. Now we can. Yes, start. it is my turn. And I will be back to the role. Yes. Regarding the mental ability, because yesterday that we discussed this thing, 214, 9, 26, that I gave the logic also in the 89th question. That is a 2 into 9, 14 minus 4, 14 has come in the same manner, 26, if you want to get it. Then you say that 20 into 15, sorry, 2 into 15, then becomes 20, 20 minus 4, 15. So, in that analogy, that 15 is the right answer, that is the fourth is the right answer for the 89th question that we gave explanation yesterday. Yes, in the 90th question, 7, 48, 12, how much? See the analogy. What is there? Plus R, minus R, square R, cube R. What do you, what do you have to delete? 48 if you want to get option it. Option 1. Yes. Option 1. Can you tell me your logic? 7, 7, 49, minus 1, 48. Yes. 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 Or minus. yes, yes. 7 into 7, that is uh, 49, take a minus uh, then 48, then 12 into 12. Then we say 44, then you can minus 1 is that 143. So that is the logic we have to make it out. Huh? See, first you have to try one thing. It is not possible, second thing. Not possible, third thing. Then we can come to the point if you apply it. To appreciate uh, the part yeah, yeah, that appreciate. Given yeah, the appreciate. Because uh, I also give the hint also. Because either it is a square or minus or plus is equal to and how much. Just look at it, then you get it. So the hint also very much important because we did such a questions earlier also. Uh, where still we can appreciate the the person those who give the right answer. Yes. Now odometer is uh, to mileage as a compass is to. I think we dealt it this in somewhere. Yes, that is uh, odometer is for the mileage and compass. No, compass is not the speed. Speedometer is the speed. Compass and the where in the navy direction. direction. It show the direction. That is the an odometer is an instrument used to the measure the mileage. A compass is an instrument used to determine the direction and the choices as A, B, C are incorrect because none is an instrument. Neither the speed is an instrument, nor the hiking is an instrument, nor the needle is an instrument. But uh, the direction it is uh, we measured through the instrument. Yes, now the 92 question. Petal, flowers, salt, pepper, tire, bicycle, base, ball, sandals, shoes. So if you see the petal flower, which is the suits in the 1, 2, 3, 4? Tire by skill. Tire by skill. Because in the flower, petals are there. Petals, Telugu le vandar endi? Rikkalu. Shnupatral. Hmm, that is the right. Eh? So, in the bicycle, it is a accessory, tire is a, so that is the right answer. Petal is a part of a flower and tire is a part of a bicycle. Okay, now, I think this is also easy thing. I am thinking, I don't know whether you can give the answer or not. Doctor, nurse, follower, employer, leader, worker, manager. Worker. Did you say? Second option. One who follows. Leader. Uh, a, a leader is a follower. Leader. We, we followed uh, Mahatma Gandhi in the independence era. So we were all followers. So now leader is followed by his followers. Yes. But uh, but but God? God uh, that is. Worshippers. Uh, devotees. 
devotees. And uh, suppose uh, Ramakrishna Paramahamsa? Disciples. Disciples, you can say. Yes. Because followers guru, is a, for a guru. guru. It, is, it is disciple. Yeah, for, for gurus, for you can say disciples. Yeah, the supplementary yeah. question, they can make it out. Gurus, disciples. And uh, uh, for the, for the like, uh, people like leaders, followers. So these are the things that we can make it out. Okay. Now, now, now the 94th question is uh, Konark. Master, it is servant. Yes, yes. Yeah, relationship is called. That is called fiduciary relationship. That relationship are called fiduciary relationship. Master and servant, and a doctor and a patient, and a lawyer and a client. So these are the fiduciary relationship, you can see. Okay. Konark, Madurai, Khajuraho. They are famous for their temples. They were totally destroyed by the invaders. They have some of their very famous forts. And they were the capital of the Hindu kings in ancient times. Which one is the right answer for the four? Konark is a famous temple. Madurai, many temples are there. Khajra, temple famous. So the right answer is? Option one, sir. One. Option yeah, one. For the temples. Yes. They are famous for the temples. Yes, they are famous for the temples. Okay. Ninety-fifth question. Can anyone read? Unmute and read. Ninety-five question. Find a pair that is similar to the given pair of numbers. 180 is to 90. Yes. One eighty four is sixty four is thirty seven, two is one, twenty three is ten, two is two thirty seven is option two. Option two. two means this is eighty means one eighty means two times to the ninety. Yes. Is it two or is not? Two is to one. That is the right answer. Feedback is appreciate. Clearly the relationship is here is two into x colon x. Here x is ninety. 2x is 180. So, option is 2 is to 1. So, that is the right way. Okay. Next. That is sixth question. ZA5 Y4B XC6 W3D Then what is the dash? Number 1. E7V2 V2E3 VE5 4 VE7 See the relation. Option 2, sir. V2E. Option 4. Option 4 is the right answer. Why? <laughs> See the right relation. Answer. See, Z, Y, X, W. One should be decreased here. Means it should be V. Are you following me? Here, A, B, C, D. But uh, position is changed. Then next is E. Again, 5, 6. This is 5, 6. I means jump. And here, 3, 4. Means, is it decreased or increased? V2E. Then the right answer is VE37. There are three series of look for here. The first letter of alphabet is reverse. Z, Y, X, W, V. The second letter are in alphabetical order beginning with A. That is the number series is followed by 5, 4, 6, 3, 7. So the right answer is V, E, 7 for the 96th question. Now let us go to the 97th question. That is a look carefully the sequence of symbols to find the pattern. Select a correct pattern. Is it pattern is visible or not visible? Because I want to make it black. It is not becoming black. So here, like uh, E in a reverse M, then E is there. There are all reverse E is there. E E, e reverse. Then E is vertical. Then E is uh, top sitar V. Then E is vertical. Then what is the option question? Three, option yes. Three. Option three. Option three. <laughs> It is very easy to make it out. See how 
see this they made it to totally topsy turvy e and here the first one the one and uh, three is uh, vertical but only down is uh, e when you see that thing here it uh, this is only one is there and here all things should be up is it not then option three is up this option three is up so three is the option is that that is the thing this is the alternating series in the first segment letter e faces right then down then the right in the second segment the letters all face down that to follow this pattern is the fourth segment the letter must all face up so face up is three so that is the analogy explanation okay india new delhi jamaica anyone love city is there in jamaica kingston is there kingston jamaica love city is there jamaica's capital is kingston yes and jamaica we also read uh, who is that uh, person who is the fastest man in uh, sprint bolt 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 usain bolt usain bolt is from jamaica and jamaica capital is kingston and kingston love the sea what is there in the kingston cricket, cricket matches are played there yes okay okay one of the venues mm -hmm. jamaica jamaica acha very good kingston kingston yeah king there is a kingston cigarette also you would have heard it like berkeley is the place of the name and kingston is the place of the name so those are names are there at the time but of course it's no more now okay 99th question in a code corner is written as g s v r i v how can central be written in that code see here i have given d f o u s b m g i r x v p let me make down one place so that you could see it in proper yeah now you can see proper so now you see what is comes here c there is a g is there yeah, m n o option 2 so, uh, what what is the analogy what is the analogy c c stands for g i just okay. looked at two letters uh, okay, okay. Uh, i i i stands for uh, that uh, uh, this o stands sorry uh, e stands for i okay so g i r x v e p Okay. Okay. Only yes. looking at two letters only, I could catch it. I'll find so, out. Uh, okay. So participants uh, take it as a clue because uh, it's it's for you. Whenever uh, you can guess it easily, you can uh, get the chance to choose the correct answer. Option two, sir. Yes, it's option two is the right answer. As our co-host also given that. Uh, so you try first look keenly what equation it is here. Is it stand for or one minus, one plus, uh, one above, one below? How it would be? You test it. Then automatically you will get it. Then here you can say that it is a two is the answer for that one. That's why the explanation that I did I not even uh, didn't go deeper into the remaining letters. Just because it, it like already that already that is fixed in your brain that equations. <laughs> Immediately you applied the equation over there. Okay, now the hundredth question: W F B T G D Q H G. Then what sir. comes? Option two. Very good. See, you go in the reverse order. Option two. Yes, sir. Mine. You go in the reverse order automatically. I J K L M N O and here G H Q reverse order and F B. So the answer is the option two N I K. Yes. In each of the following question, arrange the giver word in a meaningful sequence. Then choose the most appropriate sequence from amongst the alternative provided below each question. Number one, site. Number two, plan. Number three, rent. Number four, money. Number five, building. Number six, construction. So go in the sequence. What what is first needed? Money is needed for anything. Is it? I think so. Money without money, how can we? You buy cannot. You cannot. You cannot purchase Why? the site. You cannot make the plan. You cannot make the things in a proper direction. 
Yes, 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 yes. So first is money. Next is sight. Next is plan. Next is construction. Next is building. Next is in the proper. The right answer is the here. The fourth one. This is the right answer. If I could make it is a one, two, three, four, then right answer is four. The four is the right answer. Is it or not? Please check it. Is it or not? Then what do you have to say? Yes, sir. It is. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, that that answer should have to come. Tanda na ante tanda tanda na 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 vada. Anala sir. Anala sir. Anala sir. Okay. So one or two question is now. Uh, I think it is very easy to make it out. Reap as so you you so. I already gave one one time this example. Now you see the sequence. Which is the right sequence? Fourth one. Fourth one. As you sow, so you reap. As you sow, as means two. You means one. You see, there are two yous are there. Four is also and five also you. So which you? Fourth three, you three, you have to take. Three, three is three. the right answer. As you sow, so you reap. So that is a three, two, four, three, six, five, one is the right answer. Here, as you sow, so you reap. That is the sequence. Yes. Now, now question. Yes. New uh, course in the course. New course. Yes, yes. That is that that is the in Telugu. Mm -hmm. See, when you sow mango, you cannot expect uh, lemon. Is it or not? సార్ నిబ్బాక తోటనే అంటారు సార్ ఇంగ్లీష్ లో ఎస్ సార్ లెమన్ గార్డెన్ నో లెమన్ ఆర్చర్డ్ హియర్ హియర్ ఐఎమ్ గివింగ్ హియర్ ఇన్ దైఎమ్ రెడింగ్ Arrange the words are given below in the meaningful and logical sequence. Window, walls, floor, foundation, roof, room. You put your point. Option two, ah. Uh, option three, ah. Uh, option four, ah. Uh. Which one is the right answer? Three. Check, check once again. Three, sir. Two check once right again. Two is the right answer. Four, two is the right answer. Why two is the right answer? Because yeah. first foundation should be there. Without foundation. how could you next after the foundation what should be there wall should be there after wall what should be there window should be there after window wall should be there roof should be there then after the room and everything is there what should be there it is a room are you following me so two is the right option 421536 that is the right answer yes not let's, let's go to 104 and this is we load the gun I repeat, we load the gun and dash the sword. Fill the appropriate word from the following using the logic. When you read the interpretation of the statutes, when you come in the third, th second year, and uh, at the time, redundo red, redundo redis. This principle can be used. I quoted this example there. Redundo singular singulis. That is the actually redundo singular singulis. There we use this maxim. and uh, yes so we load the gun and uh, dash the sword pull push draw keep draw draw is the right answer because we draw the sword from where from the english yeah. english law english law from the sheath yes sheath and it's used cupboard would and it's s h e a t h sheath R cupboard, S C U double B I R D. Telugu la? S C U double B I R D. Telugu la? What are you? Ambari, ah? Hindi me to mian bolte sir. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, now let us go to the one at five. What is the name? Dash judge by beating on the peg to maintain the silence. Hammer, sledgehammer, wooden hammer, gavel. No, of course you are not supposed to give the answer. 
కావాలని పెట్టాను నేను ఇంటెన్షనల్లీ అయిపోయిట వర్ దేర్ ఇది చూసారా ఇట్ ఈస్ ఎ గాయల్ ఇట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ గాయల్ సి ఇక్కడ ఇక్కడ చూపెట్టాను కదండి ఫోటోలో కనీసం చూసారు చెప్పండి మీరు ఈజ్ ఇస్ ఎ గాయల్ సీరియల్ నెంబర్ ఫోర్ అండ్ దిస్ ఇస్ ఎ హ్యామర్ Yeah, beating and the peg. The peg is there, not down. Hmm? So it is a gavel. Hammer is like this. And this is called a sledgehammer, which can be handled by the two hands. And where we can, the blacksmith will use, or iron smith will use. And the wooden hammer, when you denting, denting, you know, denting. Sotal the edam. In Telugu. Yes, a bonnet or any other thing with the carve is there, there the dent is there. Then they will make it to use the wooden hammer at the time, the bait is there. Now let us go to the 106 question. Yes, let us. The below photos is axe, hatchet, electrician hammer and carpenter hammer and find out the correct and name them. See, I have given the carpenter hammer. I changed it. Photos are different, names are different. So now you make it out which, which is suitable for that one. Which is called, what is called. The first photo shows, what is that? The first photo shows, it is a axe. The second photo shows, right hand, Carpet. it is a hatchet. And uh, that below down, the third of, below down, third photo to the extreme left, uh, it shows, is an electric uh, hammer, means electrician use hammer. In the right hand side, you extreme right you will see there is a carpenter hammer where the claw is there to draw the to draw the claw nail. is there to draw the nail. nails yes now you can tally it which one is the right and which one is the wrong here 1a 2b 3c 4d or 1d 2c option 2 option Two. Option 3 is the right answer. 2 and 3 same. No, no, no. It is the difference is there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are right. You are right. I, I appreciate. 2 and 3 is the right answer. Yes. You are right. 2 and 3 is the same answer. Yes. That means you have to correct it. The 1 is axe. The 2 is hatchet. 3 is electrician hammer. And the 4th is carpenter hammer. Is it clear? So carpenter hammer here. Extreme right down. Left hand, extreme left, it is the electrician hammer. And extreme, my left hand side is the axe. My extreme right hand side is the hatchet. So that is the way we can make it out. Yeah, a tree always has, which of the following is correct? Shadow, leaves, branch, roots. No roots. Yes? Roots. Roots. Without it, it will not grow. Shadow, whether it produces shadow or not, if it is having the leaves, it produces shadow. If that doesn't have the leaves in some season, the, all the leaves will be falls down. It doesn't have the leaves. The branches, yes, may have the branch, may not have the branch. Like coconut. How do you say exactly? Correct way of, no, no co-host. Coconut. It doesn't have the branches. Exactly the, what is the word that you can use? 